right, that's kind of a bummer. I was going to try to live stream um, Bottle Feeding Hope, but I guess there might be rules that you have to have a thousand subscribers to be able to live stream using your cell phone. From what I saw from a quick Google search, I could go live from a webcam, um, possibly, but the, I guess my cell phone won't work, which is what I usually use to film, because I don't have like a legit camera. But we're just going to feed her. So for now, I don't know if I can show this. This is what Hope is living in. It's just a little carrier bag. She is very small and it helps to keep her safe and confined and also keep in warm. So here's Hope. She was actually found by the family that I helped Manny for. They were out on a brook and they heard something crying and they thought it was a bird, but it turned out to be a little Hope. So they called me and asked me what to do and I told them for now just to keep them warm until I could get her. And then um, they were able to bring her to me. So the first thing I want to do is help her go potty. And I'm just using a baby wipe and then just gently rub the bottom to help stimulate her to go potty. Here we go. That's a good girl. Oh, you're hungry, huh? Good girl. Alright, so, um, I guess before I'm able to live stream from what I quickly gathered is I will have to have a thousand subscribers, and right now I have 123. So, if you want me to be able to do live streams with bottle feedings and things like that, uh, go ahead and subscribe to Kimmy's Kitties. I have the link um, either in my bio or in the description of whatever I'm posting. So, this is her KMR. Right now, I'm using the Breeder's Edge formula. It's been working really well for her, so I'm not switching it up. She's been doing so good and gaining weight. Oh, I forgot to feed her. Just um, I forgot to weigh her just now. Who knows? See what you're at. Well then I give it back to you. Just wait her real quick. Alright, so she's at a hundred. Oop. See oh, oh, come on. You wiggle so much. She's at 150. So after peeing she lost a gram and then she'll gain some more after eating. Here she is. She is such a good girl. So for now, I just let her eat at her own pace, and she'll let me know when she's full. Oh, she doesn't eat a whole lot, and she's not very big. Oh, I know. That's a good girl. Let's see what you're at. Your tummy seems so big. Maybe you have to go potty a bit? Alright, let's try more. Here we go. Good girl. So feisty. I'm so feisty. That's my girl. Now 
actually, I guess on YouTube I can post this as a live stream when um, you upload it. Um, it you can, I think there's an option to where you can upload it as if it's a live stream and it goes in real time. But it won't actually really be live because this is going to be pre-recorded since I can't actually go live right now for some reason. I just have to figure that out. Hey, sweetie. Come on. Are you full? Let's see. Right now she's at 150, 155 grams. So she just ate about four grams of food. Her belly's kind of big, so I do want to see if she'll pee again. I know. Or maybe a poo poo. It's okay, honey. She'll suckle on my hand when she's wanting to suckle. Yeah, honey. What a good girl. Now she's peeing. Good girl. Good girl. That's a good girl. All right, let's just see if we can top you off. Oh, too much. A little more. Yeah, all right. I think she's done for now. Let's see what you at right now. She's at 153 grams. That's good. She's at least going up a little bit. She was 99 grams when I first got her. That's a good girl. And um, she's gained quite a bit. Uh, when did I get her? It was actually a week ago. Oh, cool. Yeah, so I've had her um, tomorrow. It'll actually be a week that I've had this little girl. She was about three days old when I got her last Wednesday because her eyes were open, but her umbilical, or her eyes were closed, I mean, but her umbilical cord was gone. So um, it was an estimated that she was probably about three days old from the looks of her. But her eyes have opened. They actually opened... Um, I think it, they started opening like a day or two or three after I opened, after I um, got her. Yeah, so that's my little one and we're going to put her back away until next feeding, which will be in two hours because I feed her every two hours. Mwah! I love her. And um, this is our little stuffed animal that she snuggles with. It takes up quite a bit of room in her uh, little carrier bag. But I feel like um, it makes her think she's sort of like she has a mama, and it's super soft. We found that at TJ Maxx for like five bucks. But she'll once I close her up, she'll start going to sleep. She usually falls right back asleep after I put her in here. That's all she does right now: eat, sleep, and poop. All right. So that's it for this feeding. If you want me to film another feeding of hers go ahead and let me know that's pretty much all we do for little neonatals this um young oh i did forget to mention that i always wash my hands and use hand sanitizer before touching her or anything that i use for her because we need to keep her extra clean so that she doesn't get sick um any kind of sicknesses at this age can be very detrimental so we want to be super careful all right, that's it for this feeling. Bye.